what's up guys once again you're welcome to our channel today all right guys alamidia papa has once again been disgraced openly on channels television when he was granted interview by channels um television presenter now i want you to watch this video you are going to notice how he was bombarded with question and how he couldn't answer those questions now lamidia papa for some time have been trending for the wrong reason because of the uh confusion he has been causing in labor party and if you watch the way this lady in fact i never knew that this lady could go direct this lady especially this lady she gave it to him what to what to so i will not be able to i will not talk much i want you to just watch this video watch the moment lamidia papa was in, in fact in collect them in collect just watch this video and then after that you drop your comment let me know what you think why is it so important to you that you'll be recognized as chairman i'm not saying i'm not calling myself chairman i said acting national chairman awesome. i have nev I've never said i'm the national chairman but if aburi has step aside i'm the next person in hierarchy no that person should occupy the place except myself yeah but yeah. given the contention uh -huh. that it is causing the bad blood it is causing the divisions it's causing the distrust because a major bone of contention right now is that they do not trust that you will continue this case in court they do not trust that you are going to continue with the mandate uh in the mandate that um, mr peter will be seeking in court there, there are a lot of trust issues around your continuing uh to be acting national chairman of the party if there is a trust deficit isn't it in the best interest of your party that you step aside and say you know what if this is the situation let, 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 let then maybe somebody you. else should take over let me tell you there's nothing like distrust there's nothing like distrust this is a this is our project it is labor party project ob is our project and nobody should deviate from that project whether i am there whether somebody else is there that project must be executed by all of us Mm. So for you not big there's any uh, deficit in terms of uh, trust, they cannot be that cannot be referred to me. I, I didn't. I want to be to say to the whole world, why is he behaving the way he's behaving to me? I have never done anything bad to him. So why are they accusing you then of trying to withdraw the case or stall the case? There's, if you are accusing somebody, is it possible for somebody to withdraw a case with the word of mouth? You must have put it in writing, and I've, I've told the whole world, if you, see, if you have any evidence to prove that I have done this, I've done that, bring it to the whole world to see. They have not done that. It's mm. nothing but blackmailing. So you say that OB is our project. That's yes. what you say. Yes, I um, believe in it. Yet this same Mr. Peter OB obviously does not recognize you as chairman. He doesn't. So if that I'm, is I'm not, situation. I've not said that openly, that he doesn't, because mm. he's bound to recognize me. He is banned. He's not, he's not the owner of the party. He met me in the party. I've stayed in the party for 21 years. So it's less than one year in the party. I'm not, I'm not going to appeal for him to recognize me. He's banned to recognize me. The party belongs to Nigerians. He doesn't belong to a particular tribe. He is banned to recognize me. Yeah, but if this is a situation that you have found yourself, isn't it in the best interest, in the overall interest of the party? And perhaps at least for the duration of this uh, election petition uh, court hearing, that you step aside and maybe let somebody else whom everybody can trust to be the acting. After all, it is an internal party affair. And if this is based on trust, then you let the person whom everybody can trust take over. I will, I will, I will interpret the word everybody can trust. If I am bound to be trusted if I've been there. I've never been found wanting for the past 21 years. If he should be here now, he's the person that should be checked. If you are in the party just less than a year, and you, you, you distrust somebody who has been there for the past 21 years, who, who, is, who, who is deceiving who? He, he should be checked. I mean, because when you say some of the key leaders don't recognize you or say they don't want your presence, mm -hmm. you say Mr. B doesn't, uh, Mr. Shizoku doesn't, Mr. Aburi doesn't, several people don't. So not several. Many, these, are, these, are the, these are the people, not several. The key people. No, when you use the word key people, I, I don't want to say this in the open. Now, Obi is a Christian. Aburi is a Christian. Uh, Shizoku is a Christian. I'm the only person that's a Muslim among them. 
What has that got to do with? No, it, it has got to do with it. How? Because if, 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 you, if you don't see, believe that, this is the way it operates. How? Now, if you don't need the campaign process, don't need the campaign issue, don't need our campaign, the, the, the list of committee there was over 1,000. How many people operated it? But Less than 10. But we also understand that none of the state chairman recognize you. Don't say that. Don't say that. Let well, me why shouldn't he say that? There was no, a no, 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 no. Why well, I say I yeah. want to. Why I want to. Why I use that way. Mm -hmm. I'm not condemning that word. Mm -hmm. I'm only trying to explain why it, it must not be so. Now, before before at the beginning of this crisis, Aburi invited state chairman to uh, to Benin for solidarity. It was at that meeting that this court uh, Abuja court uh, injunction came up. And immediately had, he, he gave them a charter plane to come down to Abuja. Not only for them, he didn't know, actually know what happened. They gave him that recognition at that uh, at the headquarters. And you know today, some people worship money. But what I'm saying now, I am not against Aburi's position. I am against the, the compliance with the court order. I'm not after his position. That's why I keep on saying acting appointment. What I'm saying is that he can still come back to a position if he's able to clear his case. But for anybody to sit on that seat and disobey court order, I won't tolerate it. Did the courts expressly say that you have to be the one to sit there? No, it doesn't. The court says one of the deputies will take over. Exactly. No, I'm just telling you, I, one I, I, I want to tell you the scenario. Now, when this thing happened, a National Working Committee meeting was held, where I was elected. Then secondly, the other two deputies at the, at the, at the Akwanga Convention, that is, that is democratic. At the Akwanga Convention, we have Leta Salam as the chairman, myself the next person, and we have one lady, Lebeka. We just have two deputies that were democratically elected at that convention. Lebeka has left. I am the only one that is democratically elected. The other, the other two deputies were platform deputies. That is from the NSC and TUC. And these are people that are recommended to the party. They are not elected. They can be withdrawn by their platform at any time. I am the only one left as a democratically elected deputy. But even the people who brought this report to the who are brought or nominated by the uh, labor unions, yes. the labor unions too say, we don't recognize you. They, That's what the NLC has said. That they don't recognize They don't recognize you. That's what they have said. The party, the state party chairman, you said they were misled. They don't recognize you. If everybody but, is saying, but the law we don't recognize me. you. The law did not expressly say that you should sit in that seat. You said the law said one, one of the of deputies should sit there. It didn't say you. So well, if that is the situation that you have at hand, mm. Mr. Akpakwa, I'm wondering why is it compulsory? Why throw your party into this level of turmoil? 